uh, Gavin on this afternoon's win? Yeah, really pleased. I thought um, first half was exceptional. Everything that we uh, we want the players to do in terms of how we play in and out of possession, I thought they were excellent. Um, and again, something that you know, I feel like we, we haven't been performing poorly at all. I think we've just probably been a little bit guilty of not being clinical enough. And I think we uh, we did that first half, and it's probably gives you a true reflection of what we can do when when we play the way we want to play. And you must be pleased for Dan Turner to, to get two goals. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, all the strikers at the club have been working extremely hard. Dan got his chance again today, and um, and he took it. So he probably probably could have had another one or two. Uh, which is great for him, you know, we're really pleased, but he's got to kick on now. He knows that the players came in and obviously they're, they're really happy, but, you know, they want to hit the ground running now and want to go on a run. So, yeah, listen, really, really pleased. And I think second half as well, you know, it's, um, we spoke actually at half time about not wanting to defend the lead um, in terms of sitting on the edge of our own box. But credit to Spennymore, you know, they had nothing to lose, did they? 3-0 down and, um, and they just threw everything at us. And, yeah, sometimes you've got to uh, you've got to win ugly, and I thought second half, you know, it wasn't exactly how we would have liked it to have gone, but I think it shows that the lads, you know, are, are truly, um, truly resolute and, and worked extremely hard, and, and you know, we 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 minimised their chances, and we had a couple of our own as well. Because you came under a lot of pressure in that second half, particularly after they got the goal. Yeah. So you must have been really pleased. I think the lads, funny enough, like, you know, it was a brilliant 3 1 win for me, but I think it, it just shows you the mentality when they were slightly disappointed because, because we had spoken at half time, you know, we'd spoken about how we don't want to be on the edge of our own box, we don't want to just defend the lead, you know, you know we want our, our attack to be our defence, as, as it were. But I think we just have to remember as well, we're, just, we're, we're planning it second in the league. You know, these guys have been on an incredible run, they're a very, very good team. You know, the, the way they set out, it's a real conundrum for teams how they play. Um, and we had to be at our best, and um, thankfully we were. Like I say, the first half is as great as it was. I don't think it's too far away from how we've been playing in terms of our outcomes. Um, but we just had that final, that final touch. So you know that belief can hope, hopefully kick us on now. It's off to pick a man of the match today. Yeah, Newts is, you know, we know what we're getting from him. That's all you want from your players. You know what we, you, you want to know what you're getting. And, um, you know, we're talking about someone with an elite mentality, you know, who's a strong runner, who, who gives his all in and out of possession and has obviously got that bit of quality that can um, that can unlock teams. So, you know, we're really pleased to have him here. And, um, you know, I think he sets the tone for what it is that we want to do. I thought we just mentioned Jimmy Armstrong as well, one of the more experienced players in the squad. Uh, 90 minutes out there today and quite yeah, Jimmy's just integral to, to what we do, you know, I think um, I'm really fortunate to have the likes of him and Gaz and Gudge and, and Shep and, you know, those players who I can really lean on at times. And, um, Jimmy's knowledge and intelligence in there was just really apparent today, wasn't it? You know, I just think when you've got a, a player who's been there and seen it and done it, sometimes when you're trying to work a certain way, you need someone who's conscious enough at the time, in the moment, to be able to do what it is that you want to do. And I just, yeah, I thought he was he probably epitomised the performance, you know, he was excellent. As, as was Shep as well, who, who we say about every week. It's been a good afternoon. Well done.